This video is sponsored by Fallout Hosting. Click the link in the description to find how you can start your Minecraft server for as little as $1 a month. Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Tinkro and welcome back to another video. Today we'll be looking at an interesting topic, all the things that could have been. And no, I'm not talking about all the regrets in your life, I'm talking about all the different biome votes Mojang has given the community. And look at all the biomes that, well, lost. Also, next week, we shall do the same for the mobs. And so, without any further ado, let's get right into it. Back in Minecon Earth 2018, the Minecraft community was given three biome choices that would then be updated. Now originally, all three would get their updates eventually, but the one that won would be the first to be updated, right? Though we still haven't seen any updates whatsoever to the others. The three choices were the Taiga, Savannah, and the Desert. The desert promised us a new mob, the Meerkat, which would be super duper cute and totally ripe for a Lion King Minecraft remake. A new type of tree to add to the existing 6, a palm tree, which I can never really get right in Minecraft, and the addition of the Oasis water feature to the desert. The savanna promised to revamp the savanna to include another tree, the mighty Baobab tree, which I'm sure Redstoners would have a heyday figuring out a farm for. Ostriches, which, well, I mean, who doesn't want to be chased by a bird the size of a dinosaur? And termites, and termite mounds, which, again, who doesn't want to be chased by ant-sized creatures? Finally, we have the biome that won the vote, the Taiga biome. Officially added in the Village and Pillage update, the new Taiga biome worked in wild berries, campfires, and the infamous fox. And I'm sure we all love the Village and Pillage update for being one of the most expansive updates to the game. Then, in 2019, we had yet another biome vote. This time they promised us the same thing with all three biomes eventually getting a revamp. Though, I must point out that for a game that doesn't seem to have an expiry date, eventually could be two decades from now. Nevertheless, the three biomes were the Badland, the Swamp and the Mountains. The Badlands, which in my opinion are already kind of badass, they promised us two new plants and a mob. They were the Humble Tumbleweed, which would roll around, a new type of flowery cactus, hopefully the one Sokka found in Atla, and the Vulture, which would take the loot of explorers who found themselves in an untimely demise. Next, we have the Swamps, my personal choice at the time, which promised Minecraft players treasure boats, which I mean, who doesn't love treasure and new goodies, frogs, which I have always been fascinated by, and a new mangrove tree, which I think would have looked really, really cool. And finally, we also have the mountain biome. Now I will admit that mountains are looking kind of dull, so I'm really excited for the caves and cliffs update, and check out their awesomeness. Now we've already seen powdered snow and the goat, and from what I can tell, the generation is looking sweet. And that's about it for this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to give the video a like and subscribe to see more videos just like this one. Comment down below what you think, but until next time, thank you all very much for watching.